Max Boyer, as you said, a rising star here in, in the province of Quebec. And look at those shiny tights. So manly. I want to touch them. For those of you not aware, Max Boyer won a number one contenders uh, tournament last month. Which I was in and lost, goddammit. But you made it to the final, so come on. Hey, I'm surprised I won one match. I was saying he was supposed to have his title match this month, but Manny passed him up and gave it to Kevin Steen instead. Fucking A. Oh, 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 Max Boyer putting PCP Manny. Unnecessary roughness. He's got the boss in an arm bar here. And oh, then comes El Generico. Hammering away on Max Boyer. I guess we got this one going right now. I guess this is the opening contest tonight. Oh my god! Oh, no, it's underway. Max Boyer versus El Generico, who is absolutely destroying him from the get-go here. And there's referee Who's back there, baby. Back there making his return here to the oh IWS. My. And this crowd is going nuts. As Generico is just pounding away here on Max he Boyer. He is all over Maxim Boyer. He's got him by the hair. Just still hammering away. And especially, especially with El Generico and this attitude change he's had over the past year, joining up with Kevin Steen and Manny. Usually, you know, Jericho's a nice, fun Jericho. Generico's a nice, fun loving guy, but now he's very much business. Oh man, Max Boyer took over with a double leg takedown, but it was quickly reversed as Generico's trying to put on an armbar of his own here. Perhaps to get revenge for the boss. Oh, he's got it. He does he? Both men struggling for a little bit. Boy to, oh, Boye able to move out of it. Right. Neither man can really get a good hold on it. There you go, and finally Boye stitches in a nice side headlock. Pressing away on that one. So there's a need for leverage. Jericho trying to break it, sends Boye off the ropes. Oh, and a big shoulder tackle. You see, this is the first meeting between these two men. So right now they're really just trying to feel each other out. Feel what each, you know Boye has definitely watched the tape for this, and you know Jericho has definitely done his homework here as well. That's right, Jagged. Not only is this a first meeting, but it's a definite dream match here in this province. Definitely. As Generico, another man who rose really, really fast in the ranks of not only Quebec, but the world. Very much of it. You don't normally see Generico getting on the real wheel design. But there you go, you see the experience right there by El Generico grabbing a handful of tights, bringing Boye to the bubble, cutting off, cutting off the steam. Total shortcut. Generico with a headbutt now. Hey, shortcuts don't matter, they work. Oh, wow, slapping the prone Boye in the face. Lifting him by his head. Oh, Boye able to get a shot to the bread basket. Oh! I don't think that's so much of a good idea. Boye is a bit of a hothead, I don't know if you've noticed. A little bit of a I don't think slapping him in the face. Ah, but the chest. The chops, the headbutts. This is just a brawl this far. Not what you'd come to expect from these two, actually. Oh, my. Vicious chops from El Generico. Like I mentioned earlier, Generico right now found a hole in Boye's armor. He's really going to town on He's trying to make the man dangerous. Those Big. repeated shots to the head. Scoop slam followed by an elbow drop. Going for the cover. Right under the chin. One, two. Out. Boye going for a guillotine choke. Yeah. Generico. Generico there with that forearm right in Boye's face. He's making sure that Boye can't lift his back off the mat. He's making sure that he has the leverage to oh. make sure that he doesn't get that move. Just a vicious elbow butts on the ground there. Now hammering his head off the mat. El Generico, as you said before, the, the mean streak displayed by him is just... Uh, Small details like that. I think right now that El Generico is more dangerous as ever. He is a former IWS heavyweight champion, but I think with this attitude, this new attitude that he is going, I think he has a lot more potential. People are actually going to have a lot more respect towards him. That's right. Vicious chop once again. We are yet to actually see some revenue. That's the third slap to the face Generico has landed, and a fourth. Oh boy, he fires back with a headbutt, charges in, double leg takedown. He's hammering away now. Max Boye. Back here administering the count. Generico trying to get under those ropes, trying to block some of the shots. Oh, just crazy shot. Went to the eyes there. Very smart technique here by El Generico. He's making sure he's definitely watching himself. Because Boye, when he gets a body part, he can tear you apart. He's making sure he's playing good defensive wrestling. Right. Generico. He's got Max Boye by the hair. Lifting him up. Wow. The 
fans chanting Boye in, to the tune of Generico's old theme song, Olay, a chant which he used to garner absolutely every month here these before people, the change of attitude. These people used to love El Generico. He was like the son of these people. But unfortunately, traveling with Kevin Steen gets in your head. But like I said before, I like this year a little bit more. I think I've made love to him. I'm heterosexual now. Generico's got Boye grounded now. Looks to be a sleeper. I can't tell from this vantage point. Yes, it's definitely a sleeper. He's just trying to cut the oxygen off the Boye right here. Applying trying pressure. to cut off that blood to the head, making sure that Boye is a little bit out of it. Out of his wits. Oh, Boye able to get his arm up the third time. If it dropped and hit the mat, he would have lost this match. Trying to get the crowd behind him now. Both men rising to their feet. Boye is firing with the elbows in the midsection now. Oh, just cut off as he went to hit the ropes. Miracle smartly grabbing a handful of hair. Completely legal here in the IWS got a handful of hair. Boye went to take off the ropes. It was a shortcut, Jaggy. Hey, shortcuts count. It doesn't matter. It's not cheating unless you get caught in plus. No such thing as cheating. Generico. Usually you don't see this from Generico. He's really taking his time away and repeatedly oh, slapping wow. in the face. Now they're just trading chops and slaps here. Oh, oh man. And Boye is egging him on. Boye is oh, drop kick by Max Boye. He's up to his feet now. Generico is being sent off the ropes. Reversal perhaps. Yes, he's got the reversal. Boye hits the ropes. Duck the clothesline. Kick in the midsection. Oh. Big DDT. Sends Generico hard onto the top of his head. Very well placed move there by Boy. He's buying himself a little bit of time, trying to catch his wind a little bit, trying to get that blood back up into his head so he can really make smart decisions. That was a horrible line. I don't care. And both men are down. Referee backhand, who's trying to count? It's nice to see backhand back in the IWS ring. In my opinion, one of the best referees in independent wrestling going right now. Easily. I definitely agree with that. <laughs> both went slow to get off. There's a charge for the clothesline. Boye, hammering away now. Oh, sends him down. Big clothesline of his own. And another. Oh. Boye perhaps attempting to send Generico over to the floor. Not enough momentum. Oh, just lifts him up and drops him really hard, face first. Boye Scoop. Boye control of this match right now. Going for the German Boy suplex. Slot. Oh, beautiful bridging German that suplex. Be Only a two count for Max Boye. As devastating as that move is, it takes a little bit more than that to put El Generico away. Right. But definitely wearing the man down. You can see he's slow to get up here. He's using the ropes to help himself out. Boye is waiting. Charges in. Big clothesline. Sends him over the top rope that time. Got enough momentum on that one. The crowd. What is Boye going to do here, Jagged? The crowd is chanting him to fly. fly. Boye is not known to fly. Oh, hits him with the baseball slide drop kick. We've got a sea of fans in front of us here. I can't see shit. You took the words right out of my mouth. This crowd is heavily behind Max Boye here as they are brawling on the floor, perhaps. I'm assuming. Gotta let the action speak for itself. I can see Boy here. Oh, a big chop. Big her chop. Back. Wow. And they're coming back into the ring so I can sit back down. This smashes the face of El Generico off the ring apron. The hardest part of the ring. Up there. Very much so. It, it, it's not fun to hit against it. Just vicious. Boy nice coming way. up to the top. There you go. A big Japanese drop kick off the top rope. Boye doesn't use that top rope often, but when he does, hits that drop kick, two count. When he does, he hits that drop kick, usually goes for the headbutt. It's very effective when he hits it. Extremely, extremely. Both men have had a lot taken out of them this far. Both slow to get to their feet. Generico the slowest of the two. Boye perhaps looking for that. You see there, he's going for that snap power bomb. Right. You see Generico locking the hands over Boye's legs, making sure that he can't get the leverage to take him off. It looks, it looks like a cravat here. Oh, now he's looking for it. He's got him up. Generico able to float over. Hammering on the back of Boye. 
Let's go. Was it half and half? Oh. Half and half suplex. Boye planted on the neck and shoulder area, the upper area, upper part of that, rather, sorry. Oh, only a two count. Very nonchalant pin there by El Generico. The resilience of Max Boye. And El Generico blaming the referee, obviously, because that's what heels do. Oh, man. Only two count, this back age is signaled to us. Oh, headbutt by El Generico, sending Max Boye into the corner. He's got the legs, he's got him perched up top now. Perhaps look at another side of the face could be definitely going for that top row brain bust right there. And I have to say, if he hits that, I think Boye is done for the night. He's really one of the most devastating finishers in professional wrestling is that brain buster to the top. It's been definitely effective and useful for him this far. This move took the world by storm when El Generico hit him in the JAPW for the seventh anniversary show. It took the world by storm. And he's been using it. Oh, oh, Boye able to push him off. Boye is up top. Perhaps looking for that? Definitely that headbutt. No, oh, misses the diving headbutt. Catches nothing but canvas. El Generico for the last second rolled out of the way on that one. Definitely scouted that maneuver. Wow. Oh. Referee back A once again administering the count, but El Generico seemingly able to get up. And I'm right. El Generico just taking his time a little bit here. Definitely trying to catch the ring. You know the Boye hit his face hard on that back. Generico looking perhaps for a regular brain buster, but it's blocked by Boye. Kicking away at the leg area. Waist lock. Going for another German. It's blocked by Generico. Elbows out of it. Breaks it. Boye kicking the midsection. Looking for that power bomb. Oh. Generico able to float through in a sunset flip. Almost two count on there. He almost had, and he's going for he's the brain bust. No, he's got him over. Boye over. Waist lock. German oh. suplex. Oh! Absolutely devastating German suplex. Snap oh. powerbomb! One, two, oh, oh my god! god. Boye wins! Maxim Boye just beat El Generico! Oh my god! As much momentum as Boye's got behind him right now, I definitely consider that one an upset. Absolutely, I was just gonna say that. Oh no, we see Manny here at ringside. He's got a chair. Oh no. The crowd chanting, if I can quote them, great fucking match. And I'd have to agree. How about you? Wow. I'm still shocked that Boye pulled that one out. This has to solidif solidify Boye's status, or at least bring him up the ladder a little bit. Those are the type of matches that put IWS on the map at first. That's Hats right. off to El Generico. Manny. I'm still shocked. Manny's getting in the face of Generico here. Just shoved him a second ago. What's PCP going on Manny, Uncle Manny is chastising El Generico. I'm pretty sure he feels that Generico embarrassed him by losing to Max Boyer. Oh, man. It looks as if he's asking El Generico to attack Max Boyer with a chair. Wallop him! Wallop him! I don't agree. Do it! No. Boyer seemingly ready here. Generico drops the chair. Oh, what's going on here? This is very tough. Oh. The boy is ready for even more. He's definitely ready to bring the fight to Jericho again. Manny still trying to get him to go after Boy. Generico leap. Oh, Generico gonna leap. What? There's no way that Generico can actually possibly fathom that he has an open shot at Boyer right here. This is one of those odd moments, Jagged, where you don't know what to expect. Fans want to see them fight even more. I can't so blame him. Boy extending the hand. Manny ordering Generico to ignore it. No. No. There's no handshakes in wrestling. That's right, Manny. Get him out of there. None of that. Pick up the chair and wallop him. Manny's literally dragging Generico out of here. Oh, what's this? Generico going back in the ring. 
Oh my yes! god, he accepts the handshake face to face here. That's exactly what I'm saying. I love handshakes in wrestling. I love sportsmanship. What? That's right. What? That's right. I said it. Ladies and gentlemen, Max Boyer once again victorious here in the IWS. In our opening.